Coach, we got down early, but then had the eight, sixth run, eighth inning. Yeah. Talk about the comeback there in the eighth great, inning. With great comeback. You know, Logan Shear put a really good swing on a, on a ball. Uh, you know, really aggressive to fastball. TJ, you know, we got the bases low. Easton had a great at bat. TJ, it's kind of all kind of scrambling together in my brain right now. But, you know, they, we had some guys really, really compete, really compete. And made a great comeback, got ourselves back in it. Um, and then we made some mistakes. You know, we got some guys that just haven't figured it out yet. And we're going to keep playing the guys. We're putting the guys in there that are going to compete. And uh, we had a bunch of guys competed today when you could have just very easily just laid down and, and stopped playing. But we, we had a bunch of guys that continue to compete. And to be honest with you, we need we need about three or four more guys that haven't done a whole lot yet that need, they need to start getting on the on the bandwagon, so to speak, and, and giving us some better production to compete a little bit. If we've talked about the younger guys basically learning on the field yeah. as we go. Could you have expected some of them to be playing as well as they are for well, freshmen? And, uh, and, and I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow, to be honest yeah. with you. I mean, it's – and we're not giving our young guys a free pass just because they're young. Uh, that's yeah. that's not the deal either. Um, you know, they still got a long ways to go. We've got some guys that, that are older guys that have done really well, you know, that, that, that keep hanging in there and keep getting better. Uh, we just don't have enough guys yet that, that are doing what they need to be doing. And, and again, we've built this program on competing every single time we get a chance to play. And we've got a few guys that aren't doing that very well right now. We're going to get that correct. Looking ahead to tomorrow's doubleheader. Playing a doubleheader tomorrow, as we did last week, we've got Butler and Hudgens going out there. Any advantage to playing a doubleheader just seven days ago? You know, I think it's the right thing to do. And, you know, the people here at Middle have been fantastic to deal with. I mean, really first-class people, and they've, they've done everything, you know, the right way and treated us the right way. And I think it's the right thing to do. You know, the, the, the goal is to get all three games in every weekend. And I think, you know, with a 90% chance of rain on Sunday, I think it's the right thing to do to, to play two tomorrow. And I think it's the right thing to move it up. It's a quick turnaround. You know, it's a tough loss for us. It's a quick turnaround, but... Uh, we'll be ready to go at 1 o'clock tomorrow for the first game.